the moment of truth is here again. It's Friday today, my people in the UK. And um, I want to explain to us again the reason for the moment of truth. It is actually the moment of truth. Educative channel, enlightening channel. And we only face the truth here. And I can only, uh, how do I put it, recognize anything that is, that is coming from the honest point of, of, of um, honest point of, um, how do you put it? Because I don't know how to do like this, like this, yeah? I want to read out this uh, Olabi Siduro Jaye uh, comment because when I see some comment like this, he, 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 sometimes I'm disappointed when I look at the name because I expected the person to know better than this. So there was a campaign yesterday that we should go on uh, Amazon and give Olukoya's books a bad review. And all the channels that is fighting for the truth, for fighting against injustice, should do the same as well. And there's a tag that we should all go to all the immigration um, websites, tag them. UK immigration, USA immigration, Germany immigration, uh, France, all those places that you know all these liars go to, to even Saudi Arabia. Let them see, let them know the evil these men and women are doing and stop them from going to all these countries. Because when God had enough of Pharaoh, and he determined to let the people of God, his own people, go out of the bondage of Pharaoh. God, go all out on Pharaoh to make sure the people of God are delivered. So, we are not going to let any, any stone unturned. If you, if you want to do, um, uh, how do you put it? Ah, my God, help me today. If you want to do uh, your religiosity, not this time around, please, it will not work. Anyway, this person wrote, I don't agree with you destroying Olukoya's book. I don't attend MFM and will not do. Imagine. You do not attend MFM and you will not do. And we should not destroy the evil works. Of Olukoya. I was there for five years. A lot of people that, that, that were there for 40 years, for 25 years, Olukoya destroyed them. And you say we should not destroy his books. What The books has no good thing to offer anybody. Even he will come and boast that Saudi Arabians are using his books. He said he was going to Saudi at a point and they stopped him. They stopped him and uh, he was having problem issue with the immigration. And when they realized that he was the author of certain book, and they let him in, they said, ah, we've been using your books. What are the um, other religions using his book for? Because they could identify with his books. It's full of occultic stuff. It's not for Christians. When I was there for five years, his tapes, his books, everything, that I bought, when I realized what E stands for, the lady, and I wanted to destroy it, the lady that came, that I met in uh, RCCG Manchester, a witch, a witch, a no witch. She was the one that collected everything. I said, I should not destroy them. I should not waste them. She collected everything. What is she going to use them for? She can use them to be doing evils. Those books are full of evils. The first time I read it, ah, fear, I could not sleep. I could not finish reading. The woman that introduced me to MFM too called me because we bought the book the same day. She called me. She said, did you read the book? I said, I started reading it, so I could not. So the woman said she couldn't sleep, oh, 
the fear, the stuff that was in that book. Is that the book you'll be patronized? you never be to MF, MFM and you will not do and you are encouraging people that know MFM not to, do, not to go against the books. So you want, you want people to, con, to, to, be, to continue to be destroyed by, MF, by, by Olukoya's stuff. I don't get the mindset of Nigerians anymore. I don't understand. Then this person continued to say that the greatest thing for a believer is to know God and understand his word and have intimate relationship with him. That's correct. The strong Olukoya's books will not change people. Who still told you? Who told you? He changed me, oh, and he changed many people that left Olukoya. Only evil people will be reading Olukoya's books. Only evil people. All those prayer points were from occultic realms. Were from, from the water. The prayers that destroy people. Is that what you want people to be learning? Ah, I'm disappointed at this person. And this person goes on to say, believers are supposed to grow in the knowledge of who God is and this needs to be progressive. To be progressive by doing evil is the only, only thing they need to know. The Bible, the word of God. The knowledge of all these men are evil knowledge. Knowledge from the occultic world. The Bible is there since I've been reading the Bible. My life has been beautiful and beautiful and beautiful every day. And I will read the, 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 the testimonies of others like as well. You will then be able to run away from falsehood. How would you run away from falsehood? When you are saying they should not destroy Olukoya's book. See the way they are mixing evils with the truth, lies with the truth. And this is the same spirit in the lives of all those pastors. They will tell you small truth and they will tell you hundreds of lies. So you'll be confused. So people are deceived because they are slothful and lazy to search for truth. See the person, the same person. This is the key. Instead of people pursuing God, they pursue men of God. This is the spirit of Pharaoh. And yeah, by reading Olukoya's book, I did not pursue the men of God. Is it not his knowledge? That he puts in the in, in in his books. See what I'm saying now, my people. No God for yourself. Oh, all these counselors here and there, counselors. Nobody have the solution to the problem that is going on in the world today. Only the Word of God. Only God Himself. You have to know the mind of God for yourself before you go anywhere. Ask God. Ask for the leading of the Holy Spirit. See how people are perishing. Because they, 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 they carry their, their legs, their legs carry them into a wrong places, into wrong hands that, that uh, eventually claim their lives, claim everything. Ah, I'm disappointed at this. Anyway, the person that, that actually, I, I responded, if you want to go and read this, go and read my own response as well. Because I didn't expect this person to write these things. So, another person, Seru Shada, now say his books are full of occultic secrets and ungodly, and ungodly. They brought nothing but nightmares and did not solve any problems. Exactly. We will give genuine accounts to reading them. People must be warned. We are telling, can, you, can we force anybody? We cannot force them. What we can do is to just put the information out there, just to caution people. So it's now left for you and your, and your, and your conscience. And your conscience. But you have to be evil to be, to be reading Olukoya's book. They are not good at all. They are not good books. Have you read your Bible? Your Bible is important. Why are you obsessed with his book? You are bewitched. This person is responsive, responding to Olabisi. Go and read the original source, the Bible. Learn your scriptures and be free. Thank you. Thank you. These are the kind of mind I want here. Please don't come here and mislead my people. I'm here. I'm doing my best to enlighten people. I've been in the church for 40 years. 
40 years. I'll be 65 years next month. My 40 years, even over 40 years in all the churches. They are all evil. Don't come here to solicit for any of them. Don't, don't do that. It is wrong. It is misleading. And it's not helping anybody. Mixing truth with the lies is not something we need now. We have to be all out. All out for all out for all these men. Judgment of Pharaoh. We have all, we have to declare judgment of Pharaoh. We look at that is planning. Telling people to be lying against innocent people in order to destroy them because they know his secrets. Is that the person people should be reading his books? Is that the person people should be associating with? Ah, I'm disappointed at this pe person. Another person wrote, all well. He wrote, this person says, books that are glorified devil and demons. Putting fear in the hearts of men. Strong enough as if the devil is the most powerful, where, whereas they are beggarly elements under the feet of a believer by the blood of Jesus and his death. Books that, 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 that do not glorify the name of Jesus. B books that make you, that reduce you as a person of God. They put fear in you. You fight demon, fight demon, fight demon, fight demon every day. Is that the books that should be on the counter? No. We say no to this advice. Now, look at your moons. They are now threatening now. So this one, I blocked him anyway. They will still be seeing my videos, but they won't be able to comment nonsense. He's saying it's a new account. He just opened the account just to be going under any video that come against, that speak against or talk against Olukoya. He's telling me now, because we did a campaign that uh, they should stop Olukoya's book on Amazon. He said, your behavior and write-up is not even Christ-like. Can you imagine their brains? Go, take a chippy. You cannot stop the work of the Lord. Which work of the Lord? Which work of the Lord do look you are doing? Is it work of the Lord locking people up for nine years? Innocent people asking police sirs, to be tormenting them. Parents are crying for their children. They went and begged him. I cried when I heard uh, Olufemi's mother saying that she went there. She held on to Olukoya's legs. I was saying, Olon Olukoya sha anu for me. Olon Olukoya sha anu for me. Hey, mother begging you. Olukoya. Who do you think you are? Olon Olukoya have mercy on me. The woman was saying that because they were, you know, they were ignorant. They were all Muslims. They don't have the knowledge of the word of God. They don't have the knowledge of Christ. They do not have the knowledge of the work of Calvary. That's why they were begging you. Oh, 99% of people in Olukoya's church are Muslims. They are Muslims. He is a Muslim himself. A lot, a lot of people, a lot of them are from a traditional background. So they, they, they didn't even know the work of Calvary. They don't know their right as a Christian. So the woman was saying that, and the only thing Olukoya would say to the woman was that, Mama, are you not Yoruba? The woman said, yes, I am. Okay, if you can do this, tell your son to confess to all the offenses. Ah, the woman said, my son is not a thief. My son didn't commit all this offense. I cannot advise my son to, 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 to confess to what he did not do. He did say Olukoya. That this one is saying uh, they cannot stop the work of the Lord. Is that the work of the Lord? Have you said that in the Bible? Have you said that Jesus did that in the Bible? Bring out any of your pastors that actually emulate Christ. That we can see Christ in their behavior. Bring any of them out. And let me read this one again. He said, Apple of the eyes. Apple of the eyes of who? Of Olukoya. Referring to there was a time a lady name, then she he called the person's name, was speaking against Olukoya and she had to pay hundred thousand pounds in damages. 
one ought to be very careful of what they of what they open their mouth to say against uh, to 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 say against Olukoya. Do some deep search on the matter. On the matter, there is a lot to know. See. Mrs. BKM, rubbish, talking rubbish. And I responded though, because I'm reading all my, all my comments and I'm responding to all their foolishness. A lot of people flow Lukoya. You go and do your research. So, Wore, flow Lukoya. Oh, flow Lukoya. And Lukoya have to pay. Have to pay him for damages. Have to pay his uh, court case, court, uh, court fees, court costs. And many people like that, Olukoya will not come and tell all of you. Another one is pulling it with Olukoya in the, in, in the court of law in the USA. Olukoya will go to prison. He's inserting his fingers in people's private parts. That case is going on now in USA. They have the proofs. One of the ladies that inserts his fingers into their private part, the guy died. The guest mother is still alive. They have all the proofs and everything. Is that the work of the Lord? How many people have you heard that our Lord Jesus Christ fingered? Or his, his apostles fingered? Is that how to do deliverance? You people, you are just putting hands. You put your fingers into our mouth. You want us to release more deadly, more damaging secrets. If that's what, what you want, continue. Some people are still backing up Kumuyi as well. Kumuyi, that young people are bashing him now. That you told us in our 30s, we should abstain from sex. Abstain from sex. Deprive them. Deprive them from, 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 from getting married to, to their choice and all that. Only for Baba to run after a woman. Virgin Mary, they called her. At the age of 70. After his own wife died, he cannot hold himself. They are asking him a question now. He cannot come up and talk. He said he has relocated to the UK. Everybody is talking. Come out and tell us that you have not relocated. He cannot do that because he's a British citizen. They will, re they will revoke his visa. They will revoke his passports. They will take everything from him. He lives in the UK. He does not live in Nigeria. Some people were even say it was a recorded uh, uh, something that he's doing with his members. I don't know. I, I'm not there. You see, what all these men are doing, they destroy a lot of lives. Have you seen their behavior in Christ? If you cannot see their behavior in Christ, then shut your mouth. You are not in position to be fighting for them, to be defending them. We've left them into the hands of God, and God is dealing with them now. But we do our own bits. Like I said to you, that one that is coming to the UK to be collecting Abrahamic seed, that if they want to enter into the Abrahamic covenant, they have to be giving him money. All of them. They are lying to people that is helping them to obtain visas are lying in their visas application. Tag the home office. Tag UK immigration. Tag everywhere. Go to their website. The, the their website will give you instruction on how to do it. Put the links of their videos there. What they are doing, explain it there. That's how, that's how we, we, we managed to stop from care Felix Adejumo for roaming about in the in UK and USA. We, they, they stopped it in 2018. Let the authority know what these men are coming to do in the UK, in USA, in France, in Germany. They've destroyed Nigeria. Let them stay there. Don't run here. Don't run up and down. We are the Deborahs. We are the Deborahs. Deborahs, rise up. We are the uh, John Knox. John Knox, say, give me, give me uh, Scotland or I die. We are the John North of our time. Why are you folding your arms? They are destroying the work of Calvary. They are destroying the name of Jesus. I was watching with some group of boys that are doing rapping the other day. 
Come and see the way they are messing up the way the, the, the name of Christ. Come and see the way they are messing up the Bible. I was just crying. Can you blame them? Can you blame them? No. Because we don't see God in any of your pastors. All your pastors are liars. From Adeboye, Olukoya, Oyedeko, um, Ashimolowo, um, the one we are talking about, Kumuyi. They destroy everything. Those boys were saying everything accurately about all your pastors. And they are saying, Bible is a lie. Jesus is a lie. Ah, God, this is what these men have done for 50 years. Now they are telling us that, Mr. Hotspur is telling us that they, they, they've not been preaching gospel. So what do you want to know? Have you still seen that? Have you still watched that? Why are you still backing them up? Are they the one that died for you? Or you yourself, you do not believe that Jesus actually went to the cross as, as Calvary? You do not believe. I don't think you do believe. Anyway, I saw this. It breaks my heart. When people that are supposed to know better come here to write nonsense, the bullies wake up. John not of our time. Wake up. Let's rescue Nigeria. If evil things are happening, our people back home. Families are crying. Mothers are crying. Two guys were killed. Because they went to do hook up with a wrong person. This is the this is the country. This is what your pastors turn the country to. Someone left a message for me and said. Uh, we jackpot because the country is not good. But they told us that they were the one that is making, that, that their prayers that is making Nigeria to be better. Now that the Nigeria is destroyed, that now they themselves, the jackpot. The person was right. I put that comment in one of my videos. Go and check it out. You see the comment there. If I still find it, I will put it there. My people, know what you are doing. Wake up. Let's fight. Let's fight for our faith. Don't let them destroy the name of God. I'll see you on my next video. Bye for now. Please read the comments. It's here now. Read it. Thank you.